that students are often confused that history optional is a very vast syllabus so how do they prepare the subject and what are the strategy they should uh, acknowledge see basically this is not a good conception to tell that history hmm. is a very vast hmm. syllabus but it is true in context of other subject like we have uh, some language subject mathly we have sanskrit we have anthropology sociology right so in compared to that subject history is a vast syllabus but it gives us a lot of uh, wealth in terms of knowledge in the other arena so right. suppose that if a student read history as an optional subject this is going to help them especially in uh, history gs paper 1 also okay. suppose in gs paper 1 the total the total weightage of the gs paper 1 is around 30 to 35 percent of history right so at least out of 20 questions asked in gs paper 1 five to six questions have been asked from history only okay. apart from our paper one gs paper one this is also going to help in prelims hmm. because about 18 to 20 percent of the weightage of prelims is from history right and other subjects are interrelated to history hmm. so first of all apart from being a vast syllabus hmm. there is a benefit of the history okay. and also this is not so much vast because we if we read four to five books that is a selected book in history if we read that we are going to cover the syllabus if any student read and give at least two to three hour daily basis for five months they or she, he or she is going to complete the syllabus within five minutes and revision one minute no one is going to uh, lack any information in history so this is not a vast syllabus mm -hmm. but in terms of knowledge it keeps a lot of information